Good morning. I'm Helen from Georgia, and I'm out here bright and early this morning, having my coffee, enjoying the, the day, the morning, and the, all the birds and butterflies, uh, and all that the God has made for us to enjoy. I am enjoying it. So I, I hope y'all are having your coffee too, because people are telling me that they have coffee with me when I have, have a, they watch my videos, they have coffee or some of them don't drink coffee. Some of them drink other things, which that's fine, long as we all happy and uh, whatever it is we like, that's, that's all about what life is all about. Life is all about being happy and enjoying your life and doing things that you enjoy and with your YouTube family and your friends and all the people. Thank you so much for watching my videos. And this is what I use for my projects. Portland cement and it's fine cement. It's really, really fine. It's like flour. And you buy it at Home Depot and you mix, I mix uh, water with it and Georgia sand. I get my sand off my road. I have plenty of sand. I, they sell it at Home Depot sand, but I've never bought any sand because I have sand and I really couldn't afford to buy sand and cement. So I just got my own sand, so that's what I use. And I'm going to make these little uh, little bowls that, uh, that I paint on. I'm going to pour cement in it and let it harden. And then I'm going to paint uh, a scene or a flower or whatever on it. I bought some rocks at, at Home Depot, but they were not uh, the size and the shape that, that I like. So... I decided to make my own rocks and uh, they turned out pretty good and I'm going to make some more and paint them and see how y'all like them. So that's what I'm out here doing today is uh, making these rocks and seeing how they do and I'm going to mix up my cement now and I put one part Portland cement, two parts sand and one how much water you put, you know. You don't want your uh, mix too thin or too, you know, it's just, it's better just to be kind of firm. Just mash it out where it'll be smooth on the bottom and you can paint on it. So that's what I'm out here doing now is fixing to mix up my cement and get started on this project and see how it looks. Thank y'all so much for watching this video. Have a blessed, blessed day. Subscribe and share and Click the little bell so you'll get notified when I make another video. And let's have another sip of coffee. It's good. Really, it is. <laughs> okay, let's get started on this. See y'all in a minute. Y'all, my camera wasn't on, wasn't recording when I poured my cement in, but I put four cups of cement, Portland cement, and eight cups of Georgia sand, and I mixed it up, and I found out my camera was off, so... I just put my Portland cement in and Georgia sand, and, and I... Sorry, the camera was not running. Now I'm adding my water. This is mixed for my little little rocks that I'm going to make to paint on.
little bit more. A little tiny bit more. That's what I want. About that consistency right there. Stay in my on my little thing. Okay. All right. Let's get over here now and put it in the bowls. Okay. I'm gonna put some oil on it where it won't uh, stick. Maybe. Put the cement in here. A spoon that I use it. Set this aside. There's another one. This is really a easy a project right here. This is not hard at all. This would be easy for some people that can't do the heavy stuff. Okay. There's a little, little deep bowl. Okay, there's another one. This is glass one. This I'm gonna put some uh, saran wrap on it because it uh, may stick because it, the sides are straight up and sometimes. That will cause something to stick because the sides don't give any. Okay.
Okay. That's that one. Set it around here and let it dry. I'm going to let these bowls dry now and uh, for a few days and come back and see what we can do to it. Thank y'all for watching this video. Have a blessed, blessed day. And subscribe and share and click the little bell for a notification. And let's, I'm going to have another little sip of coffee uh, before I go. <laughs> Be blessed today. And somebody will bless you, I'm sure. See you later. Good morning. I'm Helen from Georgia, and I'm out here this morning on this beautiful morning. The sun shining, and uh, the birds are singing. They were just here a minute ago, so I don't know where they went, but <laughs> they'll be back, I guess. But anyway, I'm out here this morning going to uh, work on this project that I started a few days ago. And it's these little rocks. You remember I made my own little homemade rocks to paint on because the ones I bought at Home Depot was uneven and not the surfaces that I wanted and there wasn't as big as I wanted so I made my own and this is the things that I'm gonna paint on and I made them in different uh, two are the same and this is a, a another bowl and this is another little bowl that I put it in it's sort of rounded I'm going to try that one too, so I'm going to paint these today and see how they look, see if y'all like them, <laughs> and I don't really know what I'm going to do to them. I'm going to paint on my notes. I'm going to paint some black, maybe two black and two white, and the, and whatever I'm going to do to it. I don't exactly know right now, but I'll let you see as I go when I find out my own self. <laughs> oh, let me have a sip of coffee this morning. These birds is really uh, sitting up there waiting on me to get out of their way, I think. When I'm not videoing right here, birds are all over right here they're just all over the place but when I'm out here they go out there and wait on me to get finished with what I'm doing so they can come back and eat <laughs> I hate that I bother them but this is where all the my birds come and this is where I like to come sit and watch them and see all the God's creations what a beautiful how beautiful he made everything he made everything just perfect because he doesn't make mistakes so it's got to be perfect if he made it and
and let's get uh, started. Oh, I wanted to tell y'all, I made this, this uh, cement, uh, little things out of Portland cement. This is what I used, and so this is the, the finest, smoothest cement that I've ever seen, and I have never seen too much cement, but this is the only kind I've ever even seen or had anything to do with because this is what I started using and I didn't know anything about any other kind so this is what I use and it's, it's always done good for me so that's what I'm still using so let's let's get on and get started with with the uh, painting these and, and let's see how they turn out and let's get let's get on with that uh, now and let's have another sip of coffee before we get started what y'all think about that <laughs> i think that's a good idea i had someone in uh my one of my viewers when i was making another project well i think it was one of those rocks back there that's where I put them right back there. And one of my viewers, I was having trouble with it rolling. And, and one of my viewers said, she caught herself reaching out to catch that rock <laughs> to help me <laughs> before she thought about she was, she was uh, watching it on a video. <laughs> I thought that was so sweet that people would try to help me. That is awesome. That, I just feel that my viewers relate to me somehow, I don't know, but, and I'm so blessed to have all my uh, subscribers and viewers, it's just a blessing. I've never <laughs> in my dreams thought that I could make anything like nothing out of cement because I've never ever done it before. You can do it, and you can do it when you're 80 years old. It's never too late. So that's what I'm living proof, that you can do it when you're older and you've already lived a long time. You can get out there and learn something new and, and make something beautiful, and people like it. Ain't that sweet? <laughs> so thank y'all. Let, let's get started. Now let me quit talking because I talk too much sometimes. And... I don't mean to, but I just I just get to talking and I forget to stop. <laughs> okay, let's get started. I'll talk, well, I try not to talk too much. Okay, let me get my paint out. I'm gonna turn my camera off where I, where I can get my stuff together and put it out here and start painting. Okay, I'm going to put black on this one. I guess y'all know I forgot my turntable. Let me get it. Okay. Let's see if that works better. I'm going to uh, set this over here aside, then I'm going to paint the bottoms. There's another one. I'm going to paint. 
black, I guess. <laughs> this turntable just is absolutely wonderful. <laughs> you can just sit here and just turn your thing around and no scrubbing and no falling or anything. It's just a wonderful thing for someone to do for me. That is so sweet. D. Harrison is the one that sent it to me. She is awesome for thinking of that. <laughs> I didn't even think of it myself because I didn't even know there was one like this. Okay, I'm going to set that. I'm going to pick it up and set it over here and let it dry. And then I'm going to paint the bottom of it. Okay, I'm turn this over so that black paint won't get on this white rock. Okay, now if it don't get off on my hands, I don't know why I get paint all over me so bad. Let this dry a minute and then Okay, I'm gonna put I'm gonna kinda put this up a little bit where I can see around the edges better. I'm gonna mix up some paint. The colors I'm gonna use I'm going to put some orange. Green. And yellow. I'm, I'm going to put some silicone in it. And stir it up. I was going to show y'all this silicone is just, uh, it's, it's kind of dirty, <laughs> but it's silicone. You buy it in the uh, automotive uh, part of Walmart is where I got this, and it makes little cells in your paint, 
I, I don't know how it's going to look or anything. I'm just trying it. And see what we get. I, I, if, you, if you don't try, you don't know. <laughs> I found that out. You don't. You have to try things to know if it's going to work or not. I'm going to, I think I'm going to add just a tiny bit of water with it. Not much. I'm just going to put just a small amount to uh, make it a little more I hope I didn't get too much in that one. Um, this is... <laughs> We're going to see how it works. I don't know. I'm just trying something. If it doesn't work, then it doesn't work. We'll try something else. Okay. I'm going I'm going to put the green on there. I may have to stand it up. Let me have a sip of coffee. <laughs> it's about to get cold. Okay, I'm going I'm going to put some little drops of green on here. I think I'll put a little more, some more green in here that's a different color. Mix it with it just a little bit. When you let your paint set up, it sort of don't want to come out of the bottle. It sort of gets dry a little bit in the top. And a little more silicone in that. I think my bird's trying to tell me to go on. Okay, I'm going to put some orange on that now. over a little bit on other places. Okay, let me put a little yellow on it. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to blow it with a straw a little bit. Let me get up a little closer. Okay, now I'm going to blow it with my straw.
little more green in here. Cover here. Yellow. Let me blow it some more. Bring a little of it. Some of it's coming. I think this is beautiful, like the fall colors and stuff. Okay, I'm going to let that dry. Okay, I'm going to set this aside now and work on another one.
Okay, I'm going to put, I'm going to put this one blue. And white. Blue and white and a darker blue. Let's see if I can make a darker blue. A little red, maybe it'll turn darker, I don't know. Let's see. It sort of did. Okay, let's put silicone in it now. Let me zoom up a little closer. Let me start blowing now and see what happens if I can find my straw. Let's see if I can blow it down. I need a little more white.
that is beautiful. That is absolutely beautiful. Okay, I'm going to be through with this one now and let it dry. Put this little board up under it. Set it over here and let it dry. put some of this down here and let it just go down however it wants to okay now I'm going to put oh I'm going to put some white Blow it a little. Y'all, when you're doing this, you never know what it's going to turn out. You don't know what it's going to look like. You just put it on here and it does itself. And you can blow it a little around, but when it dries, you don't, you don't know what it's going to do. I guess that's the beauty of something like this. You, you, you can kind of uh, maybe try to think about maybe what it might look like, but you don't never really know because it, it, it never. You probably can not do a same uh, thing twice and make it look just the way you want it to. But I, I decided I would try to make, uh, maybe this won't be too long. I, I, I know there's people that don't care for long videos. And I'm not one of them, you know, I, li I like long videos. But 
you know, some people don't have time, but you could go back and look at it when you have time, if you want to look at it. You might not even want to see it. Because everybody, everyone doesn't like the same things. what makes the world go round. Everybody don't like the same things. Wouldn't it be boring if ever everyone liked the same exact things? It has to, you know, be a variety of things that you that you like, I guess, to just you would get tired of the same old thing all the time. I hope you can see everything. I think I'm through with this one. Guess we'll see how it looks when it gets dry. I'm gonna take it over here now and let it dry. I got one more to do. Okay. I poured put some white in here and some purple and some some darker purple. And I'm just trying to mix up some colors that, that I think might look good together. And let's see how they going to do. I think I'm going to put this dark. I'm going to put this on it now. It's a purple. A brighter purple. You just never know look how it's gonna look till it till it starts drying and My straw, if I can find it.
That is beautiful already. Get my straw. Okay, let me blow it again. Okay, I'm going to stop. I think that it looks as good as it's going to look. It's beautiful. The colors are just awesome. So, I'm going to let this dry now and uh, come back out. I'll come back when it gets dry and we'll see what they look like then. Because they may change some. Uh, they, they don't always stay just how you... Put it on there it kind of works around and and does what it wants to do <laughs> okay i'm back out here with my with my project that i done this morning painted and i'm 
I'm going to put Mod Podge on it now and let it dry. This is sealer. This is Mod Podge Glossy Lustrous. Waterproof seal finish. So that's what I'm going to put on this now and let it dry. Let me shake it up real good. Poured it in a little bowl. And I'm going to put it on here. It goes on like this, but it'll dry clear. that on there now let me get another one that's the other one that I did it looks like fall of the year Here's the other one. This will be clear when it gets dry. Okay, this is a small one. Uh, turn it off now and let it get dry. Be back shortly. Hello. I'm through with my project. I'm out here to show you the finished project that I have. Put Mod Podge on it and I let it dry. And it's beautiful. I think it's beautiful. I'm going to close up on it some and let y'all see. Uh, how they look real close uh, and thank y'all so much for watching this video have a blessed blessed day subscribe and share and click the little bell so you'll get notified when I make another video and thank the Lord for his blessings each day see y'all in the next video thank you there they are.